If you want to know what your sign superpower is, listen to this video for your sun, moon, rising, and send this to your best friend. Each sign has a special gift, talent, superpower, whatever you want to call it. And number one is Aries. So if you're Aries, sun, moon, rising, even if you have your Venus or Mars here, you can have some of these tendencies, but it is to be super confident. Aries people are never going to shy away from something. They are always going to be bold, confident, and ready to take action. Even if they don't feel confident, they will still move in the direction that they need to go to get what they want because they understand that action is what gets them where they need to go. Now Taurus, your superpower is longevity. You are able to stick with something even if it might not be the best thing for you in the moment. Taurus people will stick to something and stay where, where it's comfortable, stay with what they know really until the end. So this is something that can be a very big superpower, loyalty, longevity, and basically just working until the job is done. Next is Gemini, and your superpower is communication. Gemini people are very witty, very good communicators, and super intellectual individuals. They're very thoughtful and not afraid to speak their mind. So Gemini people can get across their message and just overall can have great communication skills. Next is Cancer, and their superpower is protection. They will protect the ones they love, themselves, whatever it is that is their focus for the moment, they will literally do whatever it takes to protect that. So if you're a friend of a cancer, in a relationship with a cancer, have these people in your family, you know that they will literally do whatever it takes when the time comes to protect you. Leo's superpower is creativity. So Leo people are extremely, extremely creative, artists, musicians, like literally anything you can take, wood making, you can take architecture, whatever it is that they choose to focus on and they can put that creative flair on it and really make magic with that. So Leo's creativity is unmatched. Virgo superpower is organization. Now sometimes these people take a while to get to a place of enjoying organization but having that skill and that finesse with organizing and kind of strategizing, structuring, you know, putting things in their place can be such a strong superpower and if they work for a company or work for themselves, once they kind of learn how to you know put this into the right focus they can really you know nothing can stop them libra superpower is negotiating now libra people can have really great communication skills it's an air sign they can have amazing social skills they can kind of know how to present themselves in a situation to sort of you know be very pleasing and you know maybe they look the part or they're just you know speaking the part but that negotiating and you know especially within like business and even just within relationships like they can just negotiate in such a good way and that can really get them very far in life now scorpio their superpower is intensity and that's really in whatever they you know choose to put their focus on they're a fixed sign so they can be very you know loyal and like steadfast to something but it's more that intensity that they bring to the table that really no one else can match like they will do the most they will bring that you know intense energy and just kind of that almost obsession with what they're doing which can really you know get them very far in life and sometimes almost make them like an expert on things just because they have such a deep obsession to you know do something or learn about something so that can get them to very successful place with that obsessive tendency. Now, Sagittarius, their superpower is optimism. And sometimes Sagittarius people can lean to be a little more negative if something doesn't work out the way they want to. But if things are going in the right direction, if they're around a good group of people, if they are, you know, satisfied, they can be the most optimistic, fun-loving, you know, outgoing people. And it can really brighten up a situation. And if you are, you know, working with them or if you are on a project with them, they can kind of bring that you know optimistic light and just kind of high energy to the situation now Aquarius superpower is their ability to cut things off when the time comes they have kind of this detached quality and if you have Aquarius placements you know there is this ability to kind of you know intellectualize something and just sort of cut off the whatever it is that is bothering you and just move on from it you know when something's not fulfilling you serving you when something is being too you know ugh, emotional or too just not not the vibe there is this kind of cut and dry way that they deal with things and it's very it can be a little bit selfish like they have a bit of a selfish tendency to you know oh this isn't I don't like this vibe with this person anymore or this situation I'm just gonna end it and it is for their own you know self good most most of the time but if you're dealing with that person that can be a little bit jarring like whoa they really just 
cut me off like that like without a second thought capricorn superpower is definitely the way that they take things serious they really take everything super serious whether it is you know social media their business themselves how they kind of you know present themselves how people perceive them they have kind of a serious um undertone about how they you know approach life whatever it is if it's something that's supposed to be fun they kind of put a serious tone on it and that's just even if a capricorn person has like a sense of humor or whatever like they will make anything kind of into a business or into a serious uh you know thing where most a lot of other people just are like oh this is just for fun like you know maybe this is they don't look at like every opportunity as a business or as a kind of way to make money or get to power in a sense but capricorn people do like usually look at things from like that just more serious lens and it can be a superpower because it makes them more respected initially by people and just kind of makes people like want to learn from them really gives them that like authority figure pisces superpower is definitely their sensitivity now pisces people can have a very like very intuitive sense of people or of situation just like vibes you know they have this kind of intuitive energy that they uh use to get them through life to kind of understand the things around them and it can be really helpful you know you if you have this intuition and this kind of like emotional you know intellectual understanding about situations you can just kind of like sense things and sense the room read the room um it doesn't take pisces people with pisces placements a lot to get the vibe you know like some signs like you know capricorn maybe or sagittarius like a very serious very fun and outgoing like a pisces person kind of reads the situation and is like okay well how am i supposed to act or what's the vibes right now and kind of you know what's the energy like very very good at reading energy comment below your sun moon and rising and let me know if this resonated with you if you'd like to book a reading with me i have astrology birth chart readings relationship readings linked in bio